What's going on? Cal Miner here. And ta-da! Huh, what do we have today? So, got this in the mail. This motherboard uh, with just the USBs for crypto mining. <laughs> As you can see there. Anyhow though, you got eight slots where you connect your uh, GPU riser straight into it. You don't need that stupid little riser anymore. It does come with the CPU already built into it. And the only thing you do need is that DDR3 stick of RAM. Now, this guy right here, though, very easy to use. You can power it with an ATX supply or an actually a, a server power supply. But anyways, though, let's just jump straight into it. Let's roll the intro. Oh, and almost forgot. Obviously, you have to add a CPU fan. <laughs> so obviously, this is one of those cheapy Arctic fans I'm going to throw into there. It obviously supports the Intel, so let me slap around real quick. Okay, you might be asking yourself, why the hell is he unplugging a perfectly good little adapter or whatnot, what you call it? Well, anyways, the main problem was that my old one took a dump and it kind of got fried. So I had to go buy a new one from Parallel Miner and unfortunately I had to use these cheapo wires to connect to my GPU. So anyways, though, to answer your question, because I'm sure people are going to ask me why he's doing that. But anyhow, let, let's keep going, okay? Keep going. Don't get distracted. gentlemen moment of truth is coming up here power on then three two one boom all right smell for burn <laughs> nothing beautiful she turned on on the first boot all right and let's see if she posts come on yes stuff a thing post post all right she posted it to have a s yeah buddy yeah 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 it's always good when uh the first boot goes right into hive os that's a good feeling uh, let's see here. We're waiting. We're waiting. I'm still waiting. Okay. There it goes. There it goes. And I have six GPUs connected. So hopefully they detect. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Let me see. Read there a little bit. Yeah, that's a big ass mess I have. <laughs> and uh, yeah, six GPUs I do have. 
Alright, yeah buddy. Yep, six of them, you see? I was pretty happy. Yeah, <laughs> always a good feeling. Anyways though, let's uh, jump into the web GUI. Let's set some overclocks and let's see what we got going, okay? Yes, ladies and gentlemen of the world, we are in here in the web GUI. So I got here the AMD Vegas uh, rig. She is running on T-Redminer version uh, 0.10.0. And she's been running for about a one hour and two hours, it's just to be safe. So obviously as you can see, here are the overclocks that I am getting. Supposedly they're pulling 645 watts to the wall, which I seriously doubt. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it guys. There's some overclocks if you guys want to check them out. The two Vega 56 cards, or actually one, two, three Vega 56 cards, one 5600 six sig, and a good oldie but goodie. The RX 570, eight gigabyte. So, as you can see, temperatures are pretty decent, and the hash rates are pretty decent too, if I do say so myself. Uh, 41, 46, 48, and 43, okay? And if you guys wanted to know, this is the actual board that I am using. It's the B75 Mining Motherboard. It's, it's 109 bucks. I actually got them a little bit cheaper a month ago when I purchased it but i'll leave an affiliate link in the description here so you guys could if, if you guys are interested by all means and apparently they don't also do sell a combo kit which i guess comes with the ram but honestly i would just stick with the motherboard by itself but anyways though thanks again for watching if you guys did enjoy the content comment like and most importantly subscribe okay and as always guys tell someone you're loving but most importantly keep on mining till the next time guys